Hello everyone, my name is Nick and welcome back to One Shots. Uh, I'm going to explore the rest of this facility and I'm going to go um, and uh, look for the library. Uh, these robots are not functioning at a frightening rate. Physical damage from square particle anomalies is almost impossible to revert. No living person can touch them, unless they have a death wish. But if we're lucky, sometimes the squares go away on their own. But not before taking away one of the robot's arms and legs. Poor head. Okay. I cannot stop spinning! But, but you're not spinning right now. Never mind. Hey there. This is so tedious. I missed the gold days before our robot repairing robots broke down. <laughs> but what do you get to repair them? Now all the robots have to be assembled by actual people. Aren't you a robot? No. I mean, do I sound like a robot to you? I'm talking in the normal human voice. Not really, but your head is a TV. What, what does that have to do with anything? Never mind. The rules are for what is and isn't a robot in this game are weird to me. Um, it was. What the heck, I can't pass problem right now. What are you talking about? Back alley, and head to the right. Oh jeez. Leap. Do not approach. That's morbid. Well, let's keep going. Oh, there's a little baby child! Or fox, never mind. Whoa! Nicholas, do you see that fox just now? What did it say? It just ran behind that tree! I'm sorry if you're looking for me. But I cannot talk to you. What are you doing right now? Not now. Um. But can you promise me something? Huh? We can find a way to return. Please do. Er, what do you mean by that? No reply. Well, guess we know what the fox says. I regret nothing. So. It didn't take me to the, um, the library as I thought, but keep going this way. It's a faded flyer. It's a faded flyer. What did I say, Nico? Nico, you can at least try. That's a ram. Here he's marking on the wall. Looks like a ram. Very, very astute. the club to <laughs> I did that on a stupid like gamble like oh that this might not work <laughs> it's good to see you too oh so these are just all the ram doesn't react to me at all that the word boss ran in bull that one isn't a ram that one is Read only. I see. I don't get it. Secret ramp. So, we meet again. Hello. Wait, aren't you from the village? Yes, but the ramps are ever present. <laughs> the village, in the city, even in your heart. Okay. I did think this would happen. Okay, I had no idea that was actually gonna happen. I love this game. 
Rems our love, rems our life. Alright, let's go down here. Because that's going to take me back to where I was. Oh! It's ready to run in this room. Hey, Nick! Hey, Nick! Nico, it's your people! Aww. Aww. That's so cute. Oh, a cat? Are you lost? Me? Do you wish to join us? Join your cats? Yes. I'm not a cat! I don't walk on four legs like they do. I have cat eyes. My eyes are normal people eyes! Well, I'm going back home. Your hat is shaped like a cat. Well, I'm just a person! We're still welcome here. I protect lost people as well. Thanks. I'm not lost though. I forgot Nicholas to guide me. You see. Wait, did you just mention God? Do not just drop his name like that and walk away. Come back here. I, I don't know. I, something about about just dropping the name of God just just amuses me. Like a casual conversation like that. Oh yeah, just me, me and Yahweh are hanging out. Just don't worry about it. Oh okay. Wait, what? <laughs> Oh, hey there. You have a lot of fish. Yeah, I'm worried about them. Oh? I heard something about square particle stuff. Just took it out of major pipeline. Guess I should take advantage of the running wall water while I still can. Big fish tank. right now. So. Hello, person. The library is up ahead. Thanks. So I found the library. When the world ends, would it be better if it was gone in an instant or slowly fading away? To be honest, I'd rather perform her. Yeah. Sadly, that's not how it's gonna happen. First, it's gonna be a few years of tribulation. Then, the world will end. Actually, yeah, tribulation, devil rules the world, uh, then God destroys everything. Ooh. The author's books cover a wide range of topics. It seems that there are no chapters he does not write about. Quite the renaissance man, don't you think? I guess so. They've been focused on documenting the world as of late. Oh? They say this city is the last passion of civilization. Soon these books may be the only thing we have to remember the rest of the world by. Ah. What? What? I didn't say anything! Oh, Siri got me dead. I was just looking at your book! Yes, we are in a library. There are books in a library. Um, what book the chatty one upstairs? But I think that's the one I need to show the book to. Uh, oh, hello. Do you need directions? Let's see, this area here is mostly historical accounts of the reference section. And it's downstairs and, uh, I'm not sure where the children's section is. Sorry. That's okay. I'm not really looking for books. So, are you here to look for the author then? No? Oh, that's good. Or, I mean, that means you won't be disappointed. I've been volunteering here for months, but I've never seen him. Not even once. He worked together with the head of the head librarian on, on publishing. So you'd think he would at least show up once in a while. But he doesn't? Yeah, he seems kind of reclusive. It's weird for a guy who supposedly travels the world. Maybe it's just around people. What if I show her the book? I, I don't know. I mean... I don't think many people have seen him in person. Knows what he looks like. Everyone's heard of him, though. Secondhand accounts, though. Oh, and he didn't reply to my letter that one time. I got a friend immediately. Nice. I, I remember. I used to be a big fan of Captain Underpants and Dave Pilkey's works. Um, 
And I borrowed a letter to him, and he got a newsletter back, but... I don't know, this is still... Yep, still scared of platters. Hello, person. Hi! Reshelving in progress. Please watch out for potential falling books. I will. Reshelving in progress. Here, it's turning me off. Alright. So, I need to show this book to someone in here. I think I had librarians one I need to talk to. Uh, the author is so cool. I heard he could travel all over the world with a flying machine. That's how he gathers materials for his books. Wow! Hello, bookhead. Um, what are you doing to that book? Don't worry, these are my own books that I wrote. I just put them on the shelves to modify them. I have to cross out some sections. Most sections. Uh, how come? Because otherwise uh, they'll think I copied him. Him? The author. I mean, I really don't see the point of writing anything anymore. The author is just gonna write about the same thing and then everyone will love it. And nobody's gonna remember the books that came out before his. Oh, uh, I mean, I ain't hate him. See why, you can see why people go nuts over his stuff. That guy's got major talent, but it just hurts, you know? Never fun when someone, when people call you copycat for something you wrote uh, first. I can see that. People call me a cat all the time. Not the same thing, Nico, Nico but I, I, at least you're trying. Even though I'm a person and cats are pets and mousers. I sure hope people don't think I eat mice. Eh, but I guess we're in the same boat, kiddo. Okay, whatever. I wanted to see in the beanbag chair. I don't know. Beanbag chairs are actually really comfy the first time you get them, but if you don't get a very good one, I imagine they get planned out really easy. That's what happened to my old beanbag chair that I used to have. So what do you think about the author? I don't know. Here is stuff yet? If not, you should. What's... Big book with black cover on the cover. House as a companion type of guide to phosphorus. The general rule with phosphor whose glow entirely cannot be relit unless exposed to the sun. If phosphor is merely dim, it may be possible to boost it through exposure to another phosphor higher energy. Even so, the boosted phosphor will never return to its original brightness. Oh gosh. Uh, if you want to read this, you can do it yourself. I don't care. So, boost phosphor, location barons. Green Phosphor, the Glen, go ahead and pause it and read it. Um, Red Phosphor, the Refuge, go ahead and pause it and read it if you want. And I, I'm, I ain't reading through that stuff, I don't even know it. The other latest books are really something, yeah? I had a librarian just read the bunch last week. Oh? The big comp compendiums. You'll see them if you look around. Kind of different from his earlier work, so I'm not used to... I'm used to reading his travelogues and novels mostly. The author publishes books at a highly accelerated and almost inhuman pace. In fact, he has put more books in one year than most authors do in a lifetime. According to the head librarian, there is still a large amount of materials written that not yet published. One cannot help but to wonder where he can get so much done in so little time. I did the calculation, the numbers simply do not add up. Maybe he can stop time? No suspect in any of them exists in this world. Is that actually possible in your home dimension? Nah, uh, I just saw it in movie months. Got superheroes and stuff. Oh, Niku. Niko. I, I can't get to that. Oh, wait. You're going through these pages pretty fast. Actually, it's mostly pictures. Oh? Yeah, that doesn't really write books. He also illustrates them. I think he makes books out of only pictures. Eat! But I want to get to that book to read it! Stupid bean bag chairs. Oh, never mind. Big back with the black cover on the cover. There's emergences of a new ecological niches in a post sun world. Oh, okay, like the phosphor shrimp, also known as he did. did, 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 did hang on. 
Go ahead and read it. Just go ahead and read it, real quick. Oh, never mind. Never mind. That was unnecessary. But I mean, still, I'm not gonna read it. I don't care. Like, I can, I can read it later if I want to. Excuse me. Oh, you are the messiah. Welcome. When I first entered the city, a big robot told me to look for the for a library on the surface. It's the same library, right? Affirmative. Oh goody! Well, we're here. What do we do now? The big robot only said there'd be clues here. That is a question for the head librarian, George. Allow me to call her. The head librarian, George. Allow me to call her. <laughs> she is not picking up. Is she not here? She is here. She is in the archive ro archival room upstairs. When she is concentrating on her work, she does will ignore any and all phone calls for several days. Yikes! Can, we, can you go get her in person then? Leaving this post is, is not in my programming. Then can I go myself? Of course. The archival room is stuffed through the stairwell behind me. Gotcha, thanks. Okay. Sorry about that. I'm on my third cup. Can't feel my limbs. Um, but I have to stay awake. And you find out how this book ends. Um, because the author and his beautiful, beautiful crimp anglers. Oh boy. Unauthorized entry. Library card required for further access. Wait, what? Library card required for further access. I don't have a library card though. Where can I get one? This is a question for the head librarian, George. Allow me to call her. We already know how this is gonna end! I know how you feel, Nico. <laughs> he is not picking up. Dude, are you sure we can't just let me through? Letting you through without a library card is against my programming. What? Even in an emergency? My programming, my programming is not flexible. I have not been tamed. I guess taming is what whatever the um, author did to the uh, the um, engineer back in the uh, parents. Well, I'll get back to that later. here it's locked from the inside lovely so yeah oh hey there e evening news evening news are you here to purchase a copy no Tippers are for grown-ups. Grown-ups? Yeah. What does that mean? It means people aren't kids. Kids? Er, aren't you a kid? I'm a robot. I have no age. Right. You insensitive little cat person. I'm not a cat! Uh. Uh, let's pass trouble to the... Library, I think I or not the, the factory. Um, I think I need to talk to the, the repair guy. I think this is where he not where he was. 
Um, what's down this way? I know I have to pick that camera. I know I need to do that. Um, uh, yeah. But that's not gonna be enough. Hey, you looking for something? Yeah, I need to go find a library card now. Any idea where I can get one? From the library? I tried that already. First thing the charge wasn't there, wasn't here. So, uh, let me check out the factory. I guess take the stairs to the end of this street and make a turn. Well, I'll sign the stair. I just read books, right? Might help you. Thank you for your help. I guess I have to talk to her then. Mm. Oh, hey, you're back. Can I help you with anything else? Yeah. You know I can get a library card? A library card? You'll have to ask the library for that. I tried! I need to see the head librarian, but I can't get to see her without a library card. But at the same time, she's the one who gives out the library cards. Really? Hey, that sounds like George. Alright. <laughs> that sounds like George, alright. Sorry you caught her on a bad day. Aww. Wait, I know. I'll just give you my library card. Won't be hard for me to get another one. Wow, oh, thanks! And, wait, shoot! I got the front desk library bots have facial recognition. My photo on the card won't match you. Unless I have the photo on my face to your face. Um, that was a joke. Who knows, maybe you'll get lucky and the robot will take it anyway. Worst comes to worst, you can always find somewhere to take a photo. Right, so now I have to do the, um, photo thing. I can't fast travel here, even though I'm clearly outside! Uh, I think I'm just gonna end this episode here, guys. Thank you all so much for watching. Please leave a like, comment, and subscribe down below. Until next time, I'll see all of you in the next video. Bye bye!